As any woman in perimenopause can attest to, low estrogen levels can lead to several aggravating symptoms, and it can even cause certain health conditions. So this video is going to cover how to increase your estrogen levels naturally. Estrogen plays a pivotal role in multiple body systems, and most notably, it controls our reproductive system along with progesterone. Estrogen levels are highest during a woman's reproductive years, and then they fall as we age and eventually are at a very low level once we reach menopause. Now, other causes of low estrogen include PCOS or ovarian cysts, excessive dieting and extreme exercise, as well as eating disorders and pituitary gland dysfunction. There are numerous symptoms associated with having low estrogen levels, and women who are in perimenopause are very well aware of these symptoms. In fact, there are 34 recognized symptoms of perimenopause, and they're due to hormone fluctuations in estrogen and progesterone. So symptoms can include irregular periods, low libido, moodiness, vaginal dryness, anxiety, depression, breast tenderness, and even changes in your oral health, such as burning tongue and gum issues. These symptoms can certainly impact a woman's quality of life. So many women turn towards natural remedies to treat their low estrogen symptoms. Oftentimes women turn towards natural options because they want to avoid side effects of certain medications or they may be hesitant to try HRT because of past dialogues. HRT can be very beneficial for many women in perimenopause and menopause. So definitely if you're considering that therapy or avoiding it, but you're struggling with symptoms, talk to your doctor to see if it's a good option for you. So now let's explore some options for boosting your estrogen levels. So herbal supplements come to mind initially because there's a ton of options for women in menopause. So when you're looking for a good supplement for managing your low estrogen symptoms, look for supplements that contain ingredients like black cohosh and evening primrose oil. While studies are small, there is some evidence that these herbs can improve symptoms such as hot flashes and night sweats. It's important to know when you're shopping for an herbal supplement that the FDA does not strictly um, evaluate and analyze herbal supplements as it does prescription drugs, so just keep that in mind when you're shopping for a supplement. You may also want to consider adding certain vitamin and mineral supplements such as vitamin D, B vitamins, vitamin E, boron, magnesium, and DHEA. Certain foods can also boost your estrogen levels in your body. So these foods contain phytoestrogens, which are plant-based compounds that mimic estrogen in your body. So these uh, foods with phytoestrogen include flax seeds, soybeans, legumes, and cruciferous vegetables. Now, remember a really good healthy diet also contains essential vitamins and minerals, which can also help improve your overall health and well-being. So if herbal supplements, vitamins and minerals, changing your diet and eating foods high in phytoestrogen, and also trying to de-stress and improve your sleep, if those things don't work, definitely connect with your doctor to see what other options are available to you in helping manage your low estrogen symptoms. 